Boston she went. She swept the weekend at Bridgeport, apparently. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. There's a lot of uh, a lot of Mother Nature happening tonight, and we hope that uh, the good folks at Airborne Speedway in Plattsburgh can get their Northeast Dirt Car Sportsman Series race in tomorrow, and we hope that uh, when we head to the Fulton Speedway tomorrow for the opener for the Dirt Car 358 Series that uh, we can get that show in as well. But uh, all remains to be seen. Fulton running tonight with the Empire Super Sprints. So we are missing a couple of cars from the original lineup, but we will go, uh, we're probably going to end up going with what we have. As we mentioned, Francis White. So Francis White, he is going to be in this feature. He just uh, has to jump to that other car, which he's doing right now. So we're going to give him a lap to uh, get buckled in safely and then uh, make his way on out into a... Uh, vehicle he's a little more familiar with of course just uh, had his first ever feature with the panther framework 602 crate sprint cars Damian Beckler will go away from the pole in the 26 along. Scheduled to go was Francis White in the 60. O.J. White in the 94, 13 Tony Frezzo, row 3 Lyle Robinson along with the uh, scheduled to go was the 111 of Tony St. Mary Jr. Anthony St. Mary Jr. rather. Travis Berkman in the X along with the 5 of Ray Beckler, 16 of Steve Smith, Jared Gilson in the 22J and 11J of Justin Burns. So... There's Francis White in the 60. He's going to make it out. So Damian Beckler and Francis White on the front row as 15 laps will be the distance. Off of turn number four, green lights are on and we're underway. Damian Beckler, Francis White. Francis White has already got some track time. Picks up the lead down the back chute. Steve Smith makes it three wide towards the back portion of the field. He picks up position number five, picking up two spots right there into turn number three and four as they work it through corner number four and down across the line. Lap number one, Francis White in control. Francis won two features last season, and both of those came on the final two nights of racing in the regular season as they work down the back chute. 
Two car lengths of separation between White and Beckler for the race lead as they work it up into turn number three and four. O.J. White there for third. Steve Smith is fourth. Followed by Lyle Robinson to the 61 as they bring it down to the line one more time. Francis White again. Won three times last year at Mohawk when we weren't when we didn't have Thunder Cars. He took a trip up there and uh, took a couple of feature wins away from their track regulars and also picked up two wins as I mentioned at the end of the year last year. Damian Beckler still there for position number two. O.J. White back there in the three spot along with the 16 of Steve Smith. Now Lyle Robinson pulls up into position number five, which I believe is a Tony Frezzo number 13 with Berkman and Ray Beckler in the five. Working it through turns three and four down across the line one more time. Francis White in control. Four laps are complete. Fifteen laps is the distance. Beckler had a great race car in his qualifying heat earlier today, but right now finding himself trying to run down Francis White up into turn number three and four. Across the line this time by five laps down, ten more to go. And we got one around over there in turn number four. It looks like that's the Robinson number 61 machine. Sits idle over there just on the outskirts of turn number four. Trying to get it refired, but I don't think it's going to happen. Yellow lights are on with five in the books. So five laps down here in the early going of this 15 lap contest for the Sundance Leisure Thunder Car Division. They will be back with us next week. Along with the Whitesboro Plow Shop, Dirt Car 350 Modifieds, Bob Johnson Auto Group, Dirt Car Sportsman, Down at the Motor Works Limited Sportsman, and the Panther Framework 602 Crate Sprint Cars. Morris karting action kicking off or the car track kicks off their 2023 season behind us next Saturday so if you're looking for uh, some karting action to attend right back behind the main grandstands here where a lot of the top stars that you see today um, started out speaking of stars that were on that car track happy birthday going out to Frankie Caprera today he's 21 again in holding Green lights are back on, five down, ten to go. And Dakota, or excuse me, Damian Beckler picks up the lead. Look out, they're tangling there in turn number two. Uh, Steve Smith and Frezzo going after one another. So he hit the back straight away. Lyle Robinson has made his way back out in the number 61 machine. In the meantime, though, Damian Beckler has picked up the race lead as they work it through three and four. Francis White, once he gets that number 60 rolling, he's usually pretty fast. And right now, closing in on the race leader one more time. Lap number six up on the board. It is Damian Beckler in control. Down the back straightaway they go off of turn number two. Now Francis White battles for the lead down into turn number three and a four. And Francis White back to the point into turn number three and four. Seven laps will be complete this time by as they cross the line. And Francis White, the new race leader once again. Francis White holds down the top spot. Beckler and Smith, your top three as they exit turn two and down the back straightaway. We'll be coming up to the halfway point here. Eight down, seven more to go. Francis White trying to make it three wins in the last four races here in this Sundance Leisure Thunder Car Division. Won two of the last three races at the end of last year. Would love to pick up the opening day victory. Had some problems with this car on restarts last year. 
will lose spots and then spend the rest of the race trying to make him back up. But right now the car looks very strong as he rolls through turns three and four, back down to the line, nine down, six to go. Damian Beckler now under attack from the 16 of Steve Smith as they enter into turn number one and two and down the back straightaway. Steve Smith right there in spot number three working on the Beckler 26 ride as they hit the back stretch into turn number three and four. We'll have five to go this time by and Francis Blake trying to hold on and win it here. But Steve Smith closing in up off of turn number four across the line. Number 10 goes up on the board. And Steve Smith, your new runner-up, as they head into turn number one and two. Damian Beckler relegated to third here as they head down the back straightaway. We'll be coming around for lap number 11. And White trying to hold on again. Had some track time earlier on with the Panther Framework 602 crate sprint car. I'll tell you what, Francis, Wright, Francis White is using a lot of brake out there. Either that or he's got a brake problem. You can see the rotors actually glowing cherry red on that ride as they work down the back straightaway. You can probably see it going down into turn number three. You'll see when he gets on the brakes, those rotors are warm out there. See him right there, cherry red going into turn number three and four. Might be able to see it a little better coming down the front straightaway as well. As he holds the lead with three to go. He's able to get to victory lane. We'll talk to him about that brake problem. And we just heard it up here in the tower. This report of a, uh, you can smell the brakes on that 60 car. We'll see what happens though as White continues to show the way. Not losing any ground whatsoever to our runner up right now who is Steve Smith. Two to go this time by Smith trying to run down the race leader if he can. Beckler still there for third as we got two laps to go. White trying to hold on. Smith trying to run him down. Possible brake problem on the 60, but in any event, he is still with the race lead. And those brakes are really red right now. They're almost fire orange as they come down the front straight away. The white flag is in here. Can Steve Smith pull up and win one here? Into turn number one and two. Smith closes in into turn number one and down the back straight away they go. Final trip around. Francis White, as I mentioned, he won two of the last three races in 2022. Brings it into turn number three and four. The brake rotors are glowing cherry red on that thing. Off the corner, checkered flag in the air. And Francis White gets the victory. Second will go to Steve Smith. Damian Beckler will get third and we will head track side. 